Welcome back to Let's Play Nobody Saves the World. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here in the Land of Chocolate, also known as the Sweet Home Demi Dungeon. I'd like to start off this episode by giving a shout out to Torix00, who says, I love the puzzle solving this game. The mashups you're having to come up with, of base form, special abilities, and passives, that's quite a lot of variables floating around for you to plug and play. And you know, that's true, I had originally been thinking this game would just be, oh, what form is the solution to this problem? But, uh, the way you can mix and match does make things really interesting. Especially when you consider that the sp uh, signature abilities are locked to each form. Why should we smack those, uh, jars up there? Oops, that was the stool, but fair enough. I'd also like to give a shout-out to Clunk279, who says, It is always satisfying when the bad guy's reaction to seeing you is, Oh no, not you! <laughs> uh. You know, we have been making a lot of Simpsons references in this series, so shout-out to K.O.R., who says, The enemies cowering at nobody's advanced level give me big, Run! He's got a board with a nail in it energy! <laughs> Silly. The stairs! Who could have seen this coming? Neat. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yes. Let's go rock some face. Oh! I was kind of expecting it to just lead straight to the boss fight. I need another key. Okay! Mildly embarrassing. Let's just keep going and not think about that. Up here, guys. Uh, yeah! very much, buddy. All this money just lying around because they smashed random objects in the room with all their stupid projectiles. Who put this chocolate here? Quest is the guard, yes. Ranged abilities. Oh lord, we're not trying to level up anyway. Uh, well, obviously egg, but that works differently for everyone else. Uh, I need to get my horse and magician to A to unlock monk. Uh, slug and bodybuilder to A to unlock rogue. Then I need to get ghost to C and uh, unlock rogue before Sorry, with that just saying, before we can get unlocked Necromancer, we need to get all these guys, so... Um... Christ, who to work on? Um... I guess ma uh, Magician. Wait, what are the horse quests I have? Oh, right. Well, no wards here. Oh, and I have killed two stun baddies, so there's that. No, that just killed everybody before they were done. Fuck! That's well, not ideal, is it? Oh, 
Okay. Uh. Fuck me. What was it? Oh, what did that say? Yes, right. The impossible dungeon. Oh yeah. That's the name of the one I got today. Interesting. Also, it's the only one I've seen that has more than one symbol on it. Right, horse and magician. Kill baddies of stuff, uh, kill baddies of dark damage, hit baddies of ranger dodge! The magician quest. Okay, first infinite quest, get health, pick up health items. No Stromega certified it. Well, gee, thanks, me. I'm glad I believe in me. Pick a card three. Kill baddies of both pick a card and familiar damage. Uh, no new one for that, but okay. Um, I have more baddies of familiars. Slippery magician. I should pro I should do the breakable, shouldn't I? It'll be way easier now that I'm a much higher level. Like, which one is that? Like, level twenty-one. I should probably get in there before I go turn to level 31, or it'll be really embarrassing, more than anything else. Oh, well, I know just what to do here. First I heal, then, uh... Ranger. Speaking of the dodge ability... These ones. Uh, hit the same baddie seven times in one arrow flurry. Use dodge to avoid attacks from. That didn't count. Uh, hit multiple baddies with rats detonate. Kill baddies while guards bravado is active. Destroy them! Jesus. Ravenous. It's a lot of cookie jars. And there's a switch in the middle! zombie and turn all those guys into my minions. Now let's throw rabbits at them until it's not a problem anymore. Well, I didn't want to break any of those outside of uh, what I'm about to do to them. I 
gotta be careful about this. got to be careful about this, I was saying, because, uh, well, if that had gone more poorly, uh, I'm gonna guess, since these guys leave behind dead bodies when they run out, that he could have exploded them, too, the brain guy. I wonder why some of the coins fall flat and some of them spin on their edge. Okay, now about all these, oh, what all these cookie jars? There's still a bunch left. Yeah. Not as satisfying, but still satisfying. Oh. Oh yes, in the quest. Hat trick two. Hit more baddies. Wait, I should probably do that as the magician. Hat trick two. Hit more baddies with rabbit and tiger familiar attacks. Yeah, that's a step for the next towards the next guy. Hat trick three unlocked. Hit even more baddies with rabbit and tiger familiar attacks. Watch that become an infinite one. Oh, fuck! I would have avoided that, except I didn't. I forgot the cooldown. My bad. I didn't even go to the chest. To use up any mana. I didn't even notice that. Huh. I bet I can hit that brain guy seven times in one arrow flurry. I just bring out those, uh, brains. <laughs> Then I do this. No! <laughs> Quest complete, bench press three, hit five baddies with one bench press. Level up! Stop working on the quests, oh god. That one quest does seem to be proving very annoying. Look at that. Quest complete. Hit a baddie seven times in one arrow flurry. Arrow flurry two. There, I am glad I did that one and unlocked. Arrow flurry three. Kill eight baddies in one arrow flurry. Oh, that'll be for the skull guys, right? The ones that are made of glass. Chicken. God, it doesn't matter. In which case, there might be monsters or treasure over there. Just the key. Key acquired. You know, I was toying with the idea that all the eyeballs in this game are like a weird sex thing, but no, I feel like if it was the developer's fetish, it would have been all over Guacamelee, too. So I didn't consider it for very long. What am I doing? I don't think that's how keys are supposed to work, but whatever, man. Oh, 
Okay. I guess I'll smash him with this guy since uh, I need to work him out more than the, uh, the guard at the moment. Oh, good. Got the saws on the ground to make this so much easier. You fucker! Uh, Justin, they've put one of those brain guys behind the wall where I can't seem to hit him. You bastard! I can't even hit him with my boo aura! Boy, these guys are stupid. Keep walking right into the buzz saws. Oh, shit! That's why they keep walking into the buzz saws. I have exploded. Ah, oh, God, I made it all the way to the end. My hopes and dreams. I am ashamed. This would be very alarming for those people to see a ghost come out after that guy went in. There's another goddamn quest. Where's the skull guy coming from? Nope, I'm ignoring you. We're going to beam out of here. I'm going to try that thing I said earlier and make myself feel better about myself. Spooky! Fear baddies. Oh, and it will promote, uh, Ghost to D, at least. Unlocked! Ethereal! Pass through baddies and their attacks. Reduced move speed, minus 50%. Cost 30 mana a second. For a moment, I was, gonna, I was thinking that might be an extra passive, and maybe that's why it only had three abilities. Oh, I'm not actually the ghost at the moment, so I can't see the new quest. Ethereal 1, evade hits while ethereal. Neat. Makes him go even more transparent. Never did figure out why there's a dusted plague doctor hanging out there. Okay, before it's completely outside the realm of possibility, here we are back in Moltopia. Okay, definitely not the fucking bodybuilder. That's going to be a problem. I mean, he hits like a train, but he hits everything around him. Hey, that should be active. I should be able to skip to the boss fight. Matter things just over here. Okay, die. How do you feel being pecked apart, frickin' leeches? Oh. Oh, holy shit, the chest come back. I, mean, I guess that makes sense. I just wasn't expecting that for a dungeon I've completely completed. Hmm. Oh, the shame. Remember, you must clear the monsters inside without breaking the crystal. Stay away from the crystal, it'll all be fine. Up here, yeah, 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 yeah. And then another one over here. 
No, 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 focus on me. I'm right next to you. Is this when they start appearing around it? Because I hate that. Uh, I'm so close! Yeah, jump closer to me. Yeah, that's like... You did it! Let's get the crystal out now. The Knight Guild is sincerely thankful for your help. I hope that we can put the crystal to good use. <sighs> this place is cleansed. And I didn't even have to go back in time this time. That does make me feel better about the other thing. The breakable two out of two. Clear the monsters in the stash without breaking the crystal. Uh, and two more quests for the Knight's Guild. Stay safe inside the caves there. There are still many dangerous monsters around. I guess that's meant to be if you just went in and straight in and did it in one. How shameful. I'm actually not clear what I was meant to do there. My ranged attacks didn't seem to go in and... Oh, look at that! The fucking timer! I should less time than I thought, which means I'm very proud of myself for that. Alright, so I failed at the last fucking second at the sweet home, but the boss did seem to have more going on than I expected. Yep, the ghost does not count as a human or a mutant. We've learned this. Once you die, you forfeit your rights as a human being. about the zombie? I don't remember. No zombie was ever here. Yep, same line. Once you die, you forfeit your rights as a human being. Well, I'm a horse, and I'll see you on the next day. <laughs> Silly. <sighs> Alright, feel pretty good about that. Not gonna lie. Chill out next to this guy. What's up? I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play Nobody Saves the World. With that finally off the to do list, who knows what awaits us in the future? I guess we'll have to find out next time. Uh, Till then, just like to go out on one last note. Uh, shout out to Clunk279 who says, I guess the game's name should be changed to Nostromega Saves the World now that we know nobody's true identity. And you know, you're probably right about that, but at the same time, it's not quite as eye-catching, is it? I mean, I pretty much only clicked on this because I saw Nobody Saves the World and went, what? <laughs> uh... All right, I'll see you guys next time. Later!